Good morning, good afternoon, or good evening traders. This is John Howe speaking. Today we're going to look at one still as requested on the forum. So um, just, just the basic simple stuff. We're going to compress our weekly chart up and we can see we have a pretty good support line uh, up through the through the horizontal line, or sorry, through the parallel line up through there. Okay, that's a pretty good support and resistance through there. And if I just open up my chart now, you can see right now it's at a pretty significant um, resistance as we speak up there. You can see it's touched it three times. So it's a pretty significant level up there, but let's go and have a look at our daily chart. Let's bring up some indicators and let's see what the uh, what the overall market says. Okay, the overall market to me says that this has got some downside action to, to do because it's actually ran up too hard too fast in my view. Um, and and to me, it's got a bit of it's got a bit of breather to have to 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 um to produce. Um, I believe if I do my old Fibonacci levels from the high down through the low, uh, I believe we can get down to at least around about this this mark here, which is let me just check, which is the uh, around about the six dollar eighty. Sorry, yeah, six dollar eighty mark. So. That's where I think this stock is. I think this stock is uh, in, uh, as you can tell, it's really channeling to, the, to sideways now, and it is at a pretty good resistance now. This this would be a good stock to actually time in through the intraday. Um, I unfortunately wasn't looking at this stock. I was eyeing, I was eyeing off uh, NAB, National Australia Bank as I'll go through the stock just in a minute. So that's what I think about OST. It's pretty sideways at the moment. We had a pretty significant resistance. We can see that we've had a really overbought RSI through here, but generally the RSI, I don't really like to use the RSI as the overbought or oversold up through there because the reason is why is if you look back here, okay, look back over here, look at the RSI did, came down and just shot straight back up and the market just kept um, ticking, up, ticking on to the upside. So um, that shows me that the RSI is not really uh, reliable when it gets up to those levels. Uh, it's just is it diverging or is it converging and at the moment? It's not doing either the market's going up So the RSI so I would say that um, it's out resistant. I'm still bullish on this stock But I reckon we're going to get some bit of downside action in the short term Trade in the stock market is risky and can cause substantial financial loss We do not claim or guarantee your profit from the information provided the information in these videos is meant for educational purposes only that being said, I've been trading the market profitably for many, many years. So please, do your own homework and make sure you look after your current financial situation.